It's been a few weeks and I'm back out at the rookery with the owls and the herons and some things have changed. First there's much more vegetation out here so it's harder to see into the trees and at first I thought that the owls had actually vacated that they had um, grown up and left the nest but after watching for a while I did spot just the top of uh, the head of one of the owlets. I don't know where mom is at the moment. Maybe she's off taking a break. And I've also managed to locate five um, blue heron chicks. So yeah, lots of things going on out here. Let me show you. Let's start with the owl chicks. As you can see here, there's just the head of one popping up over the very edge of the nest. Seems healthy. I don't know where the mom was or where the sibling is, but it's very hard to see these guys from the land side. I'm hoping in a few more days to go out and take a look from the water side where I get a much better view. I spent the morning watching two nests. Nest one has three healthy chicks in it and a parent standing by to watch over them. About every two to three hours, a parent will come in with food for the chicks and relieve the parent on the nest who will then go out hunting. The parent regurgitates food for the chicks. The chicks have a voracious appetite and can consume large quantities of food each day to fuel their rapid growth. They can put on 10 pounds in just two months. Food consists mostly of fish, frogs, insects, and other small animals. After feeding, the chicks settle down for a nice morning nap. Things are very different over in nest two. First, there's no parent standing by to guard the chicks. Second, there appears to be a dead chick in the nest. You can see him just off to the right of the screen. The chicks wait patiently as the morning wears on. I was there for about four hours before a parent finally showed up. The parent starts to feed the chicks, and this is where things go, unfortunately, horribly wrong. One of the chicks becomes very aggressive over the food and kills his broodmate. You can see the squabble break out. And then, the next thing I know, the chick was hanging over the side of the nest. It appeared that his neck had been broken. Squabbles can break out over food, especially if it's scarce. But these chicks look like they're very healthy and have been well fed. Food doesn't seem to be a problem here. And the fact that we have another dead chick already in the nest gives the impression that one of these chicks is very aggressive and dominant. This is really unfortunate. Um, there hasn't been any movement from the chick for about half an hour now, so I think he's dead. She, at any rate, I think the chick is dead. Again, the parent hasn't had any reaction at all, hasn't checked the chick, hasn't even looked in its direction, so very unfortunate. Well, this certainly wasn't the way I wanted to end the day, but this is nature. However, let's end this video with something a little more uplifting and have a few more moments with the happy family from Nest One.